Sun's Virtual Box emulation software is a great uh, program. It definitely beats out Microsoft's Virtual PC 10 to 1 for sure. Its speed is greatly improved and it's somewhat easier to use. And it's got a lot more uh, customizability. And here I've got two already. I got one just for whatever I want and one specified for Quanti and Linux. All I have to do to create a new virtual machine is click New. Follow the directions. Click Next. Type in the name of it. Uh, new, for example. Choose your type of operating system if known. Like get all the windows there. All the way up to Vista and Server 2008. You got OS2, Linux, Mandriva, Solaris, L4, lots of stuff, DOS. I'll just go with other unknown, so it could be anything. Click Next. Choose your memory size, the amount of RAM it will be allowed to use. Make sure it's less than the amount of RAM you have, so that you don't, so that it doesn't freeze and not work. Recommended base memory is 64, but for larger Linux, it's maybe 256 or 512. I'll just go with uh, 60, 74 for fun. You choose the hard disk, the fake hard disk, I call it. But it's not a real one. So I'm going to create a new one. Click Next. Dynamically expanding image so it can get bigger or smaller. Choose the base size for it. I'll just choose. 141 megabytes, give it the same name, new, and it'll show the location, and finish, and now you've got that selected automatically, click next, you'll show all the information you're about to use, and then you click finish, and then you can run your operating system by clicking start, and you can uh, see I don't have a boot or medium. So you go to devices, boot CD-ROM. You either, either choose the host drive for your CD-ROM or you CD-ROM image and look for it. Click add and look for where it is. Uh, find that Linux. Open it. It's okay. I already have it selected. Select it. Select and then push enter once you click in there actually I'm going to have to reboot just have to exit out of that And then it will boot. For most versions, you push enter when it says boot. Um, okay, it's just asking me about screen settings. It'll show the booting up, and you're ready to go. You just push, if you click inside the window, you can go within, but just push the right control button on your keyboard to, get, to release your mouse so you can play around in Windows. And then just click back in there to back in Linux or whichever operating system you're running and then when you want to shut down you just right click the corner you can send the shutdown signal to the operating system save the state which will re resume next time you press start from exactly where you left off for the new feature or just completely powered off the machine and it'll close out like that and that's basically how you set up and use an operating system with Sun's virtual box I'll supply links to where to download it at the end of this video. Thanks for watching.